hello today um, I'm gonna give you my weekly update and I'm gonna start off by telling you I lost four pounds um, this is completely different than my Weight Watcher um, update that I do on Saturdays Saturdays I'm gonna recap the meetings and I'll tell you how my weigh-in is was at uh, the Weight Watcher meeting and um, this is just my weekly update this is what I've been doing for over a year now uh, I think I started it in September of 2015 so it's been like a, almost a year and a half and um, so it's two separate journeys but it's got the same goal <laughs> to lose weight and get healthy um, on this particular journey um, I started on July 17th I think it was of 2015 and at that time I weighed 306 and a half pounds Ooh, I even hate saying that it was it's just so bad to even acknowledge that fact but um, to this morning I weighed 274. So on that particular journey, I've lost 32 and a half pounds. Not to confuse it with my Saturday Weight Watcher one, because I joined Weight Watchers on December 31st, 2016, and since then I've lost 10.9 pounds. So I know it's a little confusing, but if you're on my channel, I'm a confusing person. You have to put up with me. I uh, take a lot of detours, but... That's just who I am. I can't help it. On Saturdays, though, I try to stay right to the point and get it done. On this particular one, I tend to babble. I can't help it. I just do. But I do find that uh, following the Weight Watcher program is helping me tremendously. It really is. I'm more accountable to myself. Uh, Denise always makes the joke that when I said I was using two tablespoons of dressing, I was using like a half a cup. <laughs> I was never that extreme, but... Um, I was pretty bad. I probably had a quarter of a cup and I was like they were heaping tablespoons. But now I measure everything out because um, you know you're only cheating yourself. There's, the scale is going to prove you wrong. <laughs> so you can you can tell yourself anything you want to tell yourself but uh, when you weigh yourself that's the truth and that's you know there's no no getting around that. I've tried leaning to the left and leaning to the right and lifting one leg. It still comes out to the same. So um, I have a newfound dedication. I've always enjoyed walking. Um, I never walked last year at all in the winter, which is explaining why between November, Thanksgiving of 2015, and the summer of 2016, I think I gained. I have to check back, but I know I didn't lose. Not a doubt in my mind I didn't lose. Because for the whole year, let's face it, if you took 10 pounds from the 32 pounds that I lost, I only lost 22 pounds in a year, which I'm not saying that's not good because that's good. But I could have done a lot better if I would have just stuck with the program. And when it's not so cold, I do walk outside. I do tend to walk in the house, which I find very boring. I've tried the Leslie Sansoon videos, too much like exercise. My mindset's just not to exercise yet. Um, Denise is trying to get me to watch Full Bikini Mom or bikini bop mom or something like that to do the exercises because she's doing that but uh, I'm just not there yet I'll get there but I'm not there yet um, I'm just driving along and I'm uh, not paying attention to any of the detours along the way I did uh, I don't track on Sunday well I some I track on Sundays but I don't write it down and for Christmas I got a box of chocolates and I splurged and went into my weeklies and had two pieces of chocolate, which were only about, I don't even think they are maybe that big. They are very, very, very small. And uh, it was eight points. But I, oh, I savored every bite. <laughs> and you know, before I would just pop them in my mouth and eat one and pop them in my mouth and eat another one and pop them in my mouth and eat another one. This one I took a bite and I tasted it and I savored it rolled it around, <laughs> swallowed it, enjoyed it for a half a second, and then ate the other half. Um, and you know what? The two pieces were more than enough. After I ate the two pieces, I'll be, glad, I'll be honest with you, I wanted to go and get another two pieces and just add eight more points. But uh, eight points, that's a lot of points. I did stay within my point range. Um, well, I took three points a weeklies because I, I ended up, I had uh, 43 points for the day. And... Uh, I only get 40 points so my three are for my weeklies which I'm told that's what they're there for so that's what I did um, I think I'm gonna make sorry I got an itchy note 
I'm gonna kiss a fool. Where's Denise when I need her? Um, I do think that, um, what was I gonna say? See, I lose my train of thought. That's what happens with me. Oh, I, I'm gonna still, tr you know, Sundays, that's what I was gonna say. Sundays, um, I'm not gonna completely follow because Christy comes, although we're both on the Weight Watcher program. Uh, I tend to go off a little bit on Sundays, but you know, it's my day of rest, as I say. I, I go to church and uh, and I get home and I'm just hungry. I mean, it's the same time because I go to 11 o'clock mass. I get home at 12.30. That's what time I eat during the week, but for some reason I'm a little more hungrier. I don't know why. Maybe because I was out and about with people or maybe the taste of the communion bread savored something. I don't know. Other than the fact that, you know, I received Jesus, I understand that part of it, but um, I don't know. Who knows where my thought process goes? People are still trying to figure it out, and I've been around for a long, long time, and you'll never figure me out. Just when I think I'm going to go that way, I go that way. So, um, Cindy came and picked up uh, Sophia to take her bowling, she, so she's got Kylie and Alyssa, and, and David went too. Yeah, other than that, uh, I'm going to have chicken for dinner. I'm planning my meals. I probably won't eat a lunch today because I ate my breakfast so late. I was helping, David's got uh, exams this week, so I'm helping him study. And um, algebra is not my forte. And we we were at, we had to keep reading examples and then doing it and then reading the examples. I don't understand why they teach algebra. I don't think he plans on being an engineer. If he's going to be an engineer, I completely understand that, but I don't see that in his future. So we're halfway through. I think he had 10 pages to study, and I think we've done five of them so far. So we got five more to go. And uh, he's doing well on his other ones. We've done pretty good with his other things. So I think he's going to do pretty good. His, his new semester starts. It's hard to believe that he's been here for the whole semester, and the new semester starts uh, a week from Wednesday. Time just goes by. That just shows you how fast your life is passing you by. So, oh well. Um, I'm in a good mood. I'm happy that I had a loss. And I'm going to continue on with this success. I know it because this is my year. And I have every intention of fulfilling my obligations to myself to fulfill this year. And if I had to say one of my biggest regrets in 2016 was not following everybody's advice when they told me to spend the money on myself enjoying Weight Watchers because I have to tell you, I am thoroughly enjoying this program. I mean, I've only been on it for 16 days, but um, I have no complaints. And uh, I do see me going down in the scale. So um, I hope you like the video and I hope you subscribe, comment, and share. Now, I'll see you next week, if not on my daily vlog.